what's up guys it's your girl t and i'm back again with another video for today's video i'm going to be pranking my big brother yep we are back again with another prank and for those of you that don't know who my big brother is this is a picture of him and if you've already watched the video on my dad reading my jesus love letter then you'll have got a little hint about who my big brother is so for this video we're basically going to prank him that I broke my virginity and that i slept with his close friend okay so i've already spoken to the guy and he's willing to be an accomplice and um <laughs> for those of you that know my big brother and hey, that boy is super super smart i'm even like really really worried i'm scared this prank is going to flop but trust me it's not going to flop so i'm going to try and target all his emotions play some little tricks on him and see how this goes we have got to win because that boy is way too smart and yeah so basically that's what this video is about we're going to prank my big brother and let's see how this goes let's get straight into today's video but before that i'm waiting for you please subscribe 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 before we get into today's video and don't forget to like to comment to share and all of that thank you so much for clicking to this video let's get into today's video so what we are going to do is i'll be texting him here and then i'll put a recording of our chat somewhere here in the video or something for you guys to see what happens so we are starting the class Okay, so I'm going to call him first. Let's go. So I've hung them. I'm going to call him again to let him see that I'm serious. Hey. Okay, when, when I'm serious, I don't need to go like, hey. So, um, I was already texting with him earlier today. Okay, let me see. Tony, there's a problem. You know, I see there's a problem with you. Let's see there's a problem. Tony, I need help. Yeah, so I'll say, Tony, I need help. So, Tony, I need help. Um, <laughs> should I say I messed up or I should wait for him to reply? Wait. Okay, so I'm going to wait for a few seconds to see if he replies. <sighs> Three days later. He's still not replying. I'm going to type it's emergent. It's urgent. Yeah, I just sent him it's urgent. It's like a bad situation. Are you busy? Let's see if he replies to them. Okay, so I'm going to text the guy on Amazon and tell him that um, I'm going to text him to and go like Hey B I've started the prank. So please um, don't forget to put on an act if my brother texts or calls. Okay, that's when I'm checking my brother on the card. Okay, so the guy said, alright. At uh, what time? Germany should be about 2 2 20 p.m. Because it's 1 27 here. Okay, he has replied. He's calling back, you guys. He's calling back. I don't know what to do. I'm depressed. He said he was working. Should I? What do I do? Should I pick up? Or I should text him? You guys, he just texted me that he was working, so. Let me tell him. Uh, he's asking me why I didn't answer. So, Freema, that's the name of my little star by the way. Freema is here. And I can't talk 
on the phone about this phone sheet here. Can we talk? Because he said he's working, I want to know if we can talk and then I know where to go. I want to add more spice, like I want to wait for, he said he has a few minutes, so I need to like go ahead with this, uh, okay, so I really mess, no, I'll start it, please don't be angry, hmm, what should I say, hmm, <laughs> I don't know. I think I should help me. Please don't be angry. Stop me. Don't be angry. Please don't be angry. Huh? I I really messed up. Then I say I'm a fool. Um, if it's going to get to the prank, you mind you. God, he's gone offline. Please don't be angry. Hmm. I'm a fool. The fact that he's not asking me more questions means he's very busy. So I have to. Should I? What do I do, guys? What do I do? What? He said he's not angry. I should talk. I'll tell him I met Marvin on Sunday and he, um, he took me home because he was in the estate. Um. <laughs> he said you made someone chop you. <laughs> then yesterday he took me to his place. <laughs> then yesterday he took me to his place in the afternoon. Hmm. We went to his parents there. <laughs> Like he just asked me, you slept with Marvin. You guys should I say yes or no? <laughs> what should I um. say? Um I, hmm, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how it happened. But the drink. By the time I realized I, I wasn't dressed. <laughs> By the time bed. I realized I wasn't dressed in his bed. Like and then he came to the room with breakfast food. <laughs> okay, so he's asking me why did you go to his place? Because he's your friend um, and because he's a friend and he always he said he doesn't understand why did I go to his place why did you he's still asking why did you because he's a friend and he when he dropped and I'm even confused he and when he nice dropped me person. on Sunday he invited you he said he'd come pick me to um, spend time with him and Stephanie. Okay, so Marvin has a sister called Stephanie, she's my age mate. So I'm telling him that because he's a friend, and when he drove me on Sunday, he said he'd come and pick me to spend time with him um, and Stephanie as in yesterday. Oh god, how is this going to take? Is he going to? <laughs> I'm so nervous. How did he tell to your parents? He was like, so you told mommy before you went? Yes. I'll tell him. Yeah, but no, if I say yes, he'll call my mom and ask if I went out yesterday. No. No, what I'm going to do is I'll say no. kind of <laughs> No, it was when she went to work. Sunday that she got to work. <laughs> my brother is the best, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no, I went to where she went to work. And then he's like, um, me, I always fear this will happen. Ah, well, then I have to chop Stephanie too. <laughs> My brother is a fool. Hey, I love you, baby. <laughs> I'm sending him this 
did a wind sticker like hmm. and he's like so you didn't ask permission because you knew she won't make you go exactly yeah, hmm. meaning you literally plan to go there oh no i just decided yesterday Um, he's asking me why do I think my mom wouldn't have let me go because, because she... of shit like this and I'm like you know mom Orthodox. doesn't really give me the chance to open up He's like, and if there was discipline in mom, can I? Ah. What is he saying? He's like, no, I won't put this on here. Okay, so he's coming to start the blame game. Asking for permission is not opening up. Hmm. What do I do? This is on you. It was a mistake. I know. But the me problem is he said the last sex he had was with was with this girl corner <laughs> and she probably has stds so you oh, I can't. Oh, he's like, what's the use of keeping your virginity to now to let someone who's not your anything just chop you? <laughs> and I'm like, he said um, the last time he had, um, oh, the last time he had sex, he said you're foolish. I want to go for a check up, but I don't know how. I'm sending him current stickers or something. Yes. What are those current stickers? Okay, so he's like a naive, and I and I really feared this would happen. I swear you were too friendly with boys. That's what he's saying. My brother is really hurt. I can't believe my brother believed it. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> bro, go and back your big brother. It's so fun. I want to end it because he has work. But then, and he's like, and someone can tell you I had sex with other people and decided to have unprotected sex. <sighs> bro, <laughs> I, you really should have known better. Like me. Oh. <gasps> Bro, it's a prank! <laughs> what you end there before? You made him get you way too easy. Like, nah. <laughs> hmm. I'm really scared. What if you have an STD? What's too easy now? He's conquered you as his trophy. I was like, I'm really scared. I'm so worried. And he's like, he's not your boyfriend too. I think that's where his main problem is. The fact that he's not even my boyfriend and that happened. It would have been different if he was my boyfriend, you dig. At least you would have been able to talk to him or something to like take me seriously. And then he's like, he's just a friend and he slept with you. Do you know how cheap that makes you? Like, you guys, I want to cry. I really want to cry. You hurt He's her. like, you're yeah, not worried. When I said I'm so worried, he said, you're yeah, not worried. Dude, hmm. won't you end it? It's been 13 minutes. I <laughs> he said I hope you get pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> I did set boundaries. Even on the Sunday he tried to kiss me but I pulled away and warned him. <laughs> what if he takes it so, out on Marvin? I actually thought we were just he's like and he foolishly went to his house. I'm like, bro, I didn't know. <laughs> 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 
you bullet. You all need a Tony in your life. My bad. I. <laughs> you make like so many jokes out of your serious like situation, and then you still run away to help you. So he's like, wait, you. What do you think would happen, Pastia? That you foolishly went to his house. He showed you signs, and he thought sneaking out of the house to meet him is the wisest move. He's like someone that does not respect you. <laughs> Why do you think it up on Marvin? Uh, wait, um, you put this thing is getting really, really serious. I don't know if I should end it. Just three more. He's like enough to date you before trying to kiss you. You think he had boundaries? Ooh, <laughs> my brother is taking this thing way too personal. Like, I'm not going to reply. I'm going to let him express you know <laughs> hey can you hurry i can't wait to video call him and go like bitch it was a prank this whole cool and you were okay so now he's talking about <laughs> an ex or a friend or whatever happened he's like and you were all about respect and would insult Kobe for those of you that know Kobe I'll leave it there. Yeah, right there. <laughs> and later made yourself so cheap. And Kaifi had taken his money in Bwanka. <laughs> My brother is the best. <laughs> no cap. <laughs> Doctor, I say 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 me who did that. You guys, you really need a son in your life. Like, he's actually typing a lot. I don't want to say anything. Because they have you going to and he's not even you anything. That's what's annoying me. Or oh, maybe we're secretly dating. Should I tell him we're secretly dating at a point? Should I tell him that? What if I tell him that it's going to make him um not that he's someone you loved or is building a future with. I'll tell him I swear I thought you were smarter, but nah. <laughs> I'm loving like <laughs> I'm so hurt anyway. It had, after he's done insulting me, he's like, anyway, it had happened. I'm like, I didn't even see it happen. I'm sorry I disappointed you. Well, get a car. <laughs> he's like, now you have no pride. If you don't take care, boys will use you cheeky like that. See, people. Like I was saying, you really need a turn in your life. He's like, you don't like anything. Oh, <laughs> you don't need anything. <laughs> hey, say this thing was true. Like, if I actually did it with his friend, this is the kind of insult this boy will be raining on. Hey, we had the one who insult him back. Daddy mm. gave you more money, so these things won't happen. Oh. <laughs> Wool up, nigga. Wool up, wool up, wool up. Just I'm so happy. Not knowing it's not those things that move you. It's come to insult me. It's come to insult me. Did you hurry up? So it's just basically trying to say it's not money or anything of that sort that moves me. But I'm sure that's what he's typing. He's like, someone just picked you to his house, fucked you unprotected, and brought you back. <laughs> God, that's so painful. Jimmy! <laughs> You go. He's like, do you mean? She said, I don't even know what to type. I'm like, hmm. He's like, I even sent you money. <laughs> right in my room. <laughs> what did you lack? <laughs> his house, <laughs> his TV, <laughs> his bed. <laughs> I'm like, okay. I'm sorry. What are you speaking to Marvin? I feel to? useless. I'm stupid. I'm a fool. I know. Oh, he's like, it bashed me that it's even my friend. Like, my friend. <laughs> I'm talking to someone else.
you guys i'm so sad like the phone i was using to record went off when we're recording so i have to start all over again i mean from where i ended right so um yeah, i'm so sorry i have to read it because you know the phone i was recording with had to go off so he's like like my friend and can do it to someone else ah he has told my sister for free when it's not like you needed anything from him it doesn't make sense now that you've started be very careful otherwise boys will just use you because now you have nothing to protect as you've done it before you easily give in don't be playing with boys don't go to their houses or you know, see it outside come home that's all right now on top two he did it wrong <laughs> Ryan is telling you that he has sex with a girl with STDs if you were correct Anka, you would figure out how he would send you money for checkup or take you. See how he has used you and left you to find out if you have STDs or not. Oh. <laughs> when you don't like anything, well, this is the part that was really shocking. He was like, well, your money can't be reduced. I won't buy for you because it doesn't change anything. People broke their virginity because of tough times. DB like you and made someone who is not your anything chop you for free. I think this part really really goes to my big brother because like <laughs> the fact that everything was for free and like um he wasn't even my anything so the main problem was the fact that he wasn't my anything right because i don't think the free thing actually got him so, and he's like i shit me hey i didn't know you were so naive and when it happened why didn't you tell me he tried to kiss you you did it because you wanted to sleep with him. You were curious, am I lying? All your friends talk about it. Tell me. I was like, ah, no, but that's what it. And he was like, what? Well, yeah. Now you have something to say. The house you come from. Nah, delete that name from your DP. <laughs> so I was using my dad as my DP, yeah. And he's like, I should remove my dad because I have dishonored him. All my Bible quotes and shit. Ah. And I was like, big brother. Yeah, I think that's why I ended it. I told him it was a prank. He didn't even believe when I told him it was a prank. And then I sent him a picture of my sister recording with a stand and everything and stuff like that. And he was like, I have a meeting. I was like, You love me. And then he said, We'll talk later. I see he sent me stickers, you know. So that was it. Okay, so you guys, we got my big brother and like, I'm so, 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 so surprised. The guy was like, I'm getting emotional. So he was so, so like, Dad disappointed in me over the fact that I slept with somebody that wasn't even my boyfriend. That was the part that really, really got to. It was not the sex that I had, but the fact that I cheated myself. And if I had even like gotten some benefits, or I, I was lacking something, and I did it, or I was doing it with my boyfriend, someone he knew or he was comfortable with stuff, I don't think it would have bothered him this much. And he's like, I should be careful because now that I've done it, it's like an open eye you dig. A lot of boys are going to try and it'll be easier for me to give in and stuff. This should be a lesson to you guys, those watching and stuff like that. Like, big brothers are the best. No cup. I love you, boo. <laughs> My big brothers really, really made me happy today. And Marvin, thanks for being on our conference. The people that gave me the tips as to how to prank him, Godfrey, Cindy, Nyamiche, yo, thank you so, so much. This prank was successful and I'm really, really glad. Thank you so much for watching this video and if you liked it, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to comment. Let me know what you think. Do you think his reaction was like, <laughs> what we're expecting? <laughs> I'm so, so, I don't even know what to say. Like, I'm so happy. I'm touched. I'm like, <laughs> I'm having so so many emotions right now and I'm really really grateful to you guys for clicking to this video if you want to see my next prank you guys <laughs> I'm going to be pranking my dad somewhere next week or this week I'm going to be pranking him if you want to see me prank that man because you have no idea it's so so funny if you want to see me pranking him then you definitely do want to subscribe to my channel because if you miss it I am uh -huh. So thank you so, so much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys next time for my next video. Bye. <laughs>